greats of all time, a true pioneer, Pat Summit, the winningest coach in the history of men's or women's basketball in the college game. Pat Summit is 64 years old now. In the year 2011, doc doctors diagnosed her with early onset Alzheimer's disease. A year later, she stepped down as the head coach of the Lady Vols at the University of Tennessee, a job she'd held for 38 seasons. Relatives say her health is failing, and the past few days have been, as they put it, difficult. Pat Summit became the head coach of the Lady Vols when she was just 22 years old. Her line is as good as it gets. 1,098 wins, eight national championships on Rocky Top. She won two Olympic medals, a silver as a player and a gold as a head coach. But Pat Summit's legacy goes far beyond her wins. She elevated women's hoops on the national stage. She also took a leading role in the fight against Alzheimer's, launching the Pat Summit Foundation. In the past couple of days, there's been an outpouring of support in local media, fellow coaches, former players, celebrities, and others using the hashtag PrayForPat. Among their biggest rivals back in the day at the University of Texas, they're all in, and the, the University of Connecticut, which became a, a showdown for the ages, all in stores are wishing the best for Pat Summit because she is one of the great of all time, made young girls into grown women. And when I was at Ole Miss watching her and following the Lady Rebels in the day, there was nobody better than Pat Summit. And everybody loved hating her. Today, we wish her all the